Well, good news. I was able to get out of the elevator. I had to log off and restart the game. And thankfully, when I loaded back into another server, elevators worked. So since I had to file a claim on my freelancer, we're in my Titan. We're gonna take it out here and I'll give it a try. Let's see what missions we have in our area. Uh, bounty hunting wanted. Well, let's start the bounty hunting missions. This is usually the start of them. My experience from last patch. And you gotta do one, and then you start getting more popping up. Whoa. Aegis combat assist activated. And it should be easy enough Systems to do with free. this ship. Landing gear retracted. Shields recharging. Shields up. Thank you. And please visit again. My goal is to reach 100k. Not gonna grind too much, simply because there's another money due, and I'm pretty sure they're gonna wipe all money. So I'm just gonna grind enough to have some fun. Just don't know when they're gonna pop out with uh, 3.8.2. They just released 3.8.1 today. Initiated. We shall see. Like I said, just gonna have some fun with it. Wanna upgrade some of my weapons, make them a little beefier. or something, if I remember correctly. Matter of taking Quantum them out. Travel. One little ship to start off with. Nothing too serious. Quantum travel complete. Just, you might hit some rocks. <laughs> that's, that's the worst. Yeah, see, just the one guy. We're gonna get in there. Neutralize him. Quick, fast. PC, mind you. Players fight a little dirtier and are a lot harder, generally speaking. The few I've come across, at least. Alright, see, we got bounty collecting 
authorization. So, we're gonna start getting some more bounty missions popping up in here. Little things like this, 1500, 2000. You can usually tell when they're players or when they're AI because you'll see the names usually will pop up in there. So this one is a Philip Arwood is wanted by Hurston Dynamics. See, I'm pretty sure Philip Arwood is an NPC. Then we have contracting job. So we'll just accept their offer here. Go take out. See, this is, we're getting the contract to test this basically. That first one, and now they're gonna give us a little something more here. See how well we handle them all. Oh, I gotta actually travel to him. Just locking on the whatever's near me. Right, he is all the way out there. Now we didn't really take too much damage, so it should be okay. I didn't really use a lot of ammo or missiles either. So we're going to travel out there and we're going to skip any incursion, any any stop, and I'm just going to fly right past them just so I can save on ammo. Because it's going to be a long travel. And then when I get to Delamar, I'm going to be in that area. I'm going to do some weapon shopping. That Levesk. I can never say it. Levskis. See, we're already getting pulled out of quantum travel. Something's pulling us right out. Just started. Emergency stop. And already getting Contact. yanked out. I would do it for the money, but I can't. Contact. I just can't. I don't have the time. I, I don't have the resources to sit there and just Initiate. battle, battle, battle. I don't want to have to restock. Stock up on supplies as soon as I uh, get to my bounty location. ships here Complete usually. Contact. That's what happened last time. I had to bug out and go get my my freelancer to take him out. If there's just the one ship, I'll stay and fight. If there's three ships though. Contact. <laughs> I think I'm going to head to Levisky just so if I die, I don't have to travel that far in again. Quantum travel initiated. Harbor. Quantum travel. Plus, I'll probably switch to my freelancer for this battle. Dealing with three ships. And they're going for them pretty good. Heavily armed. And last time I tried to battle them with my Titan, it was 10 minutes and I had to bug out. Ah, 
I still have the shields in this shit. So a three on one fight. With me being a rookie, very difficult. Not sure if I was a little more of a seasoned vet here. do a lot better. Wow, I just realized the panel doesn't actually fit in the window there. And there, hanger aside. Landing gear deployed. Proximity alert, head. Proximity alert, deck. Just before we land, always do this. Always refill. Uh, sometimes when they store them, it doesn't refill things. I've noticed. Proximity alert. Deck. Proximity alert. Starboard. There we Landing go. Landing complete. Weapon system is there you go. Safely landed. Now I'm going to go get my freelancer. And go back. Before that, we'll go check out Levski. Maybe uh, upgrade some weapons since we're here. Atmosphere is always cool in this area. Same with Grim Hex. Those areas feel unique. Everywhere else is just like a copy paste sort of formula, it feels like. and then just get rid of this. I'm going to claim it. Just so it disappears off the dock. Or I don't end up with a parking ticket. Okay. Also, when you buy weapons, you can't replace them if your uh, ship is on a landing bed. You actually have to have it stored to put new gear on it. We're going to the marketplace. So to the right, I want to say is Cubby, Cubby Blaster. I think is the name of them. No, catch. Conscientious objects. These guys sell armor, guns, and the mining tool, which I'm gonna pick up here. So it's 500 bucks. And each tool attachment, I wanna say. So it's 376, 253. One's a cutter. One's a mining attachment. I don't plan on doing much mining, but might as well pick them up. Ooh, rail guns. Rail guns I hear are really nice. But I'm only in here really for the mining toolkit. And then I need to focus on my ship. Here it is. I buy them here. Last time I went and bought it from the kiosk, I got locked into it. I couldn't exit for some reason. It took a lot of time, so I just come here now and buy it this way. Buy some of these. Just because it's a pain getting lost in a cave. 
you ever need to go into a cave and you kind of get stuck, lost around, can't figure things out, that's the, those are handy. Very handy. Okay, we are looking for a utility tools. I don't remember what they're called. And apparently they're not in here. I guess maybe I do need to go up to them. Last things. All right. Well, we'll go up here and buy them this way then. See if we can. From purchase. Go. Plenty of guns here. The next stop is Dumper's Depot. This is also the place where you can buy hacking tools. Um, maybe we're gonna crime stat. There's a little shop, I can't remember where it's at, but you can go in there and uh, pick up some tools insert into the machine, the computer, and hack it. There are all these. I don't know what all that stuff is yet. So we're going to come over here. We're going to check out the weaponry. So for guns. Depending on what ship I'm using, these are what are currently on the... Uh, Freelancer. I am kind of tempted to try the ballistic scatter guns. They have the sucker punch. Let's say it was somewhere around here. Or this sucker here, holy. Yeah. 69,000. Absolute distortion scatter gun, but it's huge. It wouldn't fit on any either of my ships. I can't fit a uh, the uh, turret on there. The gimbal. And I want gimbal guns. I don't want to not be able to move them around. So I had this one before. I want to say. Oh, I moved my mouse around a little bit too much. Mining laser head, so I gotta get into that racket. Try it out, at least. Um, okay. So I'm gonna go up the laser cannon. I got these before. These will go on to the, uh... Freelancer, so I get two of them. So I want two cannons and two lasers, that way I don't have to worry about running out of ammo so much. That takes care of the freelancer. Still am curious about shotgunning it with my uh, pretty ballistic scatter guns or distortion guns on my ship. My Aegis. I, ju I just don't know. I'll have to do a little bit more research into which ones to get. But they need a little bit. I can't just run with these repeater lasers. And then I've had these ones on there. Um, and they just overheat, overheat so much. So I would need to do something like power plant or shield generator or coolers. I, I think the coolers are just to keep your engines from overheating real fast. So a lot of things to figure out what you want, what works good. Because I overheat so fast in my Titan. All right, so let's equip these real quick. These are probably terrible guns too. Uh, somebody is probably watching. 
car has seen these and is like, what is that idiot doing? I do that. And then this. I like to get lasers on top, cannons on the bottom. Let's go get the ship going. We got the freelancer loaded in. Had to claim it here. So it took about three minutes of waiting. Got the guns loaded up on it. Looking fresh. Got the wing repaired. Blown off last time. It's a freighter. Well, it's quite a bit, but it's a tank. Tank with wings. to the asteroid again. Pretty sure it will. able to get it to work that's a that's a plus now I'm trying to deal with these bad guys Let's 
see these little nimble fighters. that all clear why this ship does work all right let's see if we got any other bounty missions now this one is Harato Stover see these guys are players here ten thousand dollars high prof like taking on players with that high of a level usually they know what they're doing and usually they can fight back pretty well i've come across a few of them and they move around a lot so trying to trying to get them doesn't always work out the best but this guy i'm pretty sure is an npc because there's a time limit on them. Time limit meaning NPCs. Players don't have time limits on them. I haven't accepted my call to arms. I should have done that. Forgot to do that when I relog back in. All right, let's find out where this guy's at. Oh, he's... Is that right? Still here? Oh yeah, okay. Right in my neck of the woods here. Take out this one more bounty. And call it quits. I think that'll be a successful day. Take out two bounties, or three total. Working our way up into the organization a little bit here. see okay not a lot of rocks here we go Aruto. Aruto.
I wonder how bad my ship looks. Ah, still got my weapons, still got my engines, still got my wings. And I got two missiles left. Not bad. Not bad if I do say so myself. All right, I think we're bounty hunting then. Getting some other ones in here. $3,500 one. Kind of liking that. This guy's 43 minutes. Must be far away. Let's take this one real quick. And see where he's at. I was tempted to stop, but... <laughs> they're still... They're still near me. I think I'm getting low on uh, ammo here. We'll get close to this guy and see what he's all about. Okay, here we are. Inside another asteroid. Flew me into an asteroid. Alright, here we go. Okay, that's a lot more ships than I was hoping for. Let's focus on the big guy. Or fluctuation, that's not good.
get away my shields. Really bad. Give my uh, side for a little bit here. even if it kills me. Just full on body ram slam. wanted it but it wasn't gonna happen and on that note we are done with these missions for the day all right i'll catch you all later <laughs>